great loot. Okay, it's getting old. I admit I'm just stealing that bit from Barnacles. However, May Loot Crate is here, and let's hope it's better than the May Nerd Block. We do have a shirt this month, which you should have every month, Loot Crate. The first thing we have is a Loot Crate official member card. I don't know that I actually need that, but okay. The t-shirt, and let's see what we got here. There we go. See if you guys can see that, because I can't see anything. So, Legend of Zelda, and it's got some writing around it. That's actually, uh, might be my favorite thing that I've gotten in one of these crates so far. Of course, your button, which is a Zelda. A bottle opener. Oh, this is awesome. I like the Zelda theme. Not everything in here is Zelda themed, but it needs to be. However, this is awesome. Don't go it alone. It's when he gets his little sword in the first game. And of course, it's a bottle opener and he's holding up what looks like a little loot crate. So that will, at the very minimum, hang on my refrigerator. And at the very likelihood, it's probably going to go on my keychain, to be honest with you. Now we get back to... The same complaint I had about the May nerd block. I, like nerd crate, loot block, something, I don't, whatever. If you're going to do a theme, stay with the theme. I get people like Adventure Time or whatever this is, but do a goddamn Adventure Time box. Stop giving me random Adventure Time stuff in every block or crate or whatever lately. Just stop. Stop. That said, let's see who we got. So it's collect all 12... No, oh, he's frowny face. And put him right back in that box and give him to somebody's kid. Although I do like the little tin. The little tin is cool. It's a Minecraft hanger. And I already know where this is going. No! Actually, it's the pickaxe. I might hang on to that. That's <laughs> my... Might be the best one next to the sword. You got creepers and stuff too. There's all the stuff you can get if you want to pause and look at it. Frankly, I actually kind of like this one the best. So that's pretty cool. Here, I can be like a miniature Barnacles. I'll put it up on the corner of my monitor. And uh, it'll make my monitors look ginormous. And then I can pretend I have 46 inch monitors like Jerry. We have the Friend Zone soundtrack. Sure. Some stickers, Captain Sparkles, mustaches, yay. Some more pink mustaches, a Sailor Moon, a Skechers, I don't know. There, So there's all that stuff. Whoop, whoop. You know, guys, I, I'm probably going to stop doing them. They're fun to see what's in them, but to be honest with you, I need to be like 20 years younger, I think. The chances of getting stuff that you really like seems to be low instead of just the random stuff so for like if this was all zelda stuff and it had like you know a zelda pop head and a zelda shirt and that was you know maybe there was only three things in here but they were higher quality things and they were all themed uh i would actually like the the both of them the same i have the same complaint about both uh loot, loot crate and nerd block is that it seems like they just start throwing stuff in that they can buy for cheap. Um, that's like clearance from places. I mean, that's that's how I personally feel. I don't know if that's true or not. Thumbs up. If you want me to keep doing Nerd Block and Loot Crate, thumbs down. If you think it's a waste of time and these are just trinkets and stuff and we're just killing the environment. Uh, the t-shirt was nice this month. Good job, Loot Crate. Should have one every month. So guys, if you like it, subscribe. I appreciate everybody's support. Remember, down in the description are my affiliate links. If you use my Amazon code, all the money I get from Amazon goes back to you guys in the form of giveaways and contests. But anyways, this is Tim for Timmy Tech TV. We'll see you next time.